Hey guys, Dalton here with RV Wholesalers. Today we are going to walk through the 2024 Puma XLE 30 DBSC. This camper is 33 feet 7 inches long, has an exterior height of 11 feet 1 inch, exterior width of 8 feet, fresh water capacity of 43 gallons, black water capacity of 35 gallons, gray water capacity of 35 gallons. Gives you a dry weight of 6,338 pounds and a gross vehicle weight of 8,000 pounds, which is a cargo capacity of 1,662 pounds. Let's take a walk around this 33-foot bunkhouse travel trailer and see what Puma is doing for the new year of 2024. Hey guys, Dalton here with RV Wholesalers. We're, today we're going to walk through the 2024 Puma XLE 30 DBSC. 33 foot, one inch camper, um, dual bunks in the back, single slide, very awesome setup here by Puma. Let's check it out, see what all we have to offer. Up at the front end, you do have the electric power pack on this camper, so starting off, you do have the uh, power tongue jack, uh, dual 20 pound propane tanks, but of course you can see you have the 30 pound propane tank cover. So if you do want to upgrade, you can also do that without having to swap out any um, gear or anything like that on the front. Of course, you do have your single battery box there, and of course your battery disconnect on the other side. We'll get to that once we rotate to the other side. Up here on the front, you do have your solar panel uh, quick connect here if you do want to take a suitcase solar panel with you. And of course, awesome pass-through storage there. And of course, you get a nice view of our RV Wholesalers uh, free starter kit that we t send with you every time you purchase a camper with us. Uh, 20 foot or 10 foot sewer hose, 10 foot water hose, wheel chocks, everything you need to get, get started with you free with every purchase of a camper you get uh, with RV Wholesalers. Right down here again on that free uh, electric power pack that is on this camper, uh, the electric stabilizer jacks, just press this button. It'll run down both sides, um, running the stabilizer jacks down. Does have a manual backup if you want to use that. Right directly above me, you do have yourself an 18 foot uh, 12 volt awning on this. So press one button, it'll run all the way out, run all the way back in if you'd like it to. Uh, it does have the LED strip there with that blue lighting allowing you to get awesome um, under awning presence there uh, while you're camping. And of course, if it does get a little bit of rain, you have an adjustable arm here allowing you to let all that water run off to one side. But awesome 12 volt awning there, awesome setup on the Puma. As you move back down the camper, uh, you have your easy fold down steps there with the step above that Puma puts on there with that nice kick panel with the Puma cut out on there. Moving back down, you also have your six gallon gas electric water here, still sticking with the gas electric, so that way you do get two different uh, fuel sources to keep your water warm, electric and propane. Uh, again, with those 20 to pound propane bottles. And again, pointing out our Buckeye service guarantee here with RV wholesalers. You get 10% off in the parts store, free uh, delivery anywhere in the state of Ohio. And of course, uh, a loaner RV, if something does happen to your camper and it's in here for service, we'll give you the keys to one of our rentals so that way you guys don't have to miss an RV trip. Moving on back uh, to your under awning presence, you do have a TV mount on the outside of this camper already installed. The same mount that is in on your main entertainment center on the inside works on the outside. Basically just lift up, bring that TV outside, plug it into your uh, cable hookup out here and plug it in. Already ready to rock and roll so that way you're watching TV on the outside or outside your camper. Aluminum rims on this camper with uh, Castle Rock tires it looks like. So they've um, nice keeping that cost down with those cast rock tires but aluminum rims so that way they're uh, nice and easy and lightweight easy to uh, replace if you do have a blowout or anything like that and on the subject of blowout uh, plastic uh, guard rails there so guards so that way if anything if there is a blowout easy to replace and doesn't cost you an arm or leg when you do that moving back down the camper uh, you do have an out mini kitchen with this specific one that we're looking at if you don't uh, option for this it will just be a nice storage area but you do have a mini kitchen on this specific set camper with a t mini outside refrigerator awesome setup for all your uh, spatulas and everything a sink with the dump station for your actual catch there and of course your graystone griddle back here for cooking pancakes and uh, bacon while you're outside cooking. But awesome little mini kitchen there 
underneath your bunks. And if, again, if you go ahead and order this camper, it will just be, this is an option or a storage uh, area if you don't go with that. But awesome setup. Here we are on the back side of the Puma 30 DBSC. Um, of course, you get a full size spare with the aluminum rim, so you don't, wouldn't even notice these swapped them out if you did get a blowout. Uh, do get a full size bumper, so you can put that uh, sewer hose in there if you'd like to, if you don't want to put it back in your five gallon bucket that RV Wholesalers provides with you. And of course, you get the Furion backup camera prep, so that way you can, uh, uh, if your wife doesn't want to get back behind there and help you back up the camper, or husband if you're uh, so inclined. and. Uh, you can use your backup camera to uh, help you see what's behind you while you're going down the road. Let's check out the non-camp side. On the non-camp side here, this camper does have the outside shower, and of course your city water connection is directly above that, so you can make uh, hose off your dogs while you're outside or your kids, and of course your city water connection here while you're camping, nice and easy to hook up. Um, on the slide mechanism here, it is a rack and pinion slide on the Puma XLE. Uh, they didn't skimp down just because it is a little bit smaller than their main line, the Puma main line, uh, still using a rack and pinion. So very easy to use, very easy to maintenance and uh, lots of reliability there. And of course you can put a slide awning over top of that to help prevent uh, any kind of critters dropping acorns or anything like that. And of course sticks on top of there. Let's go inside and check this camper out. As soon as you walk in the Puma 30 DBSC, you're going to notice the entertainment center here. Uh, this specific one does not have the fire electric fireplace in it, but you can option that in. Uh, lots of storage if you don't do it that way for your entertainment center. Directly above that is your head unit to control your inside and outside speakers as well as the radio if you want to listen to music. Um, of course, you have your TV mount with all your hookups to control um, Xbox or anything like that. And of course, on each side of your entertainment center, you'll see your entrance into your main bedroom. Um, there's not a lot of walk room in between, uh, at the foot of your bed, so there's entrances to each side so that way you can still move around. Um, moving directly across from there, we're going to go to the slide. Uh, light switch for lights directly above your theater seating um, and, and or, in this specific case, this is a hide-a-bed, not a hide-a-bed, excuse me, but a uh, futon-style bed. As you can see, very easy to use. And while you're sitting down, it does come with an armrest for cups and everything and lots of storage underneath for anything you want to take with you. But awesome setup. And again, you can option that out for theater seating uh, that will recline or the hide a bed option that folds all the way out into a queen size bed. So a couple different options there. And of course, a couple different color options. Cafe Latte, which is brown. This is called Slate. And I think there's a little bit darker color gray, which is called Granite. In this specific camper, we have the U-shaped dinette. Of course, this does fold down into a bed. Just lift this table up, remove the two legs, and uh, put it down on its nice little bumpers here, and it will turn into a bed. No storage underneath of here, unfortunately, as there's no drawers. Uh, but, of course, it does make a nice little bed. It, throughout this entire camper, you do have pleated shades that fold up, go up and down very nice and easy. Um, tenant, nice tinted windows, though, to keep all your cushions and everything in here from fading with due to sunlight um, and also keep the privacy and everything is uh, keep you nice and secure in here with privacy um, directly beside that in the slide you do have lots of cabinetry for all your canned goods and everything you like to take with you um, lots of storage for that cargo weight directly across from that uh, is your bathroom which we'll get to here in a second and of course uh, being in 2024, you do have your 12 volt refrigerator, uh, stainless steel in this specific one with your lots of storage space, I believe it's 10 cubic feet, but freezer on top, fridge on the bottom, awesome setup there. And of course, lots of storage below, awesome setup in the 12 volt refrigerator. And again, propane oven here with three burner cooktop on top. And of course, when you turn your going directly to your microwave, because you do have the propane oven below, you do get a regular microwave and of course your fan to get all of your smoke out when you burn your grilled cheese like I like to do. Directly beside that, you do have a single basin sink, stainless steel sink with a cutting board directly over top and a drying rack so you can butter your toast for your uh, grilled cheese and of course dry all your dishes when you're done. Directly below that, lots of storage. Pull out cabinetry with uh, little separations there. 
like the nice cab white cabinetry, keeping it a nice clean look. And of course, cabinetry above. Lots of storage, very well put together. Awesome kitchen space in this ca uh, camper. Let's go check out the bathroom. Awesome size uh, bathroom inside of here, inside of this camper with a nice vanity. Sink directly below that with lots of storage, of course. Full size toilet for all you big people. And of course, a full size shower. And of course, I'm 6'2", about 280 pounds, and I can fit in there nice and easy. Uh, do have a actual bathtub underneath of there, so if you'd like to take your kids with you and they're a little bit younger than want to actually take a bath, of course you can actually do that. In the bunk room of this camper, of course, you have four bunks for all the kids you like to take with you. Lots of storage, nice little desks to be able to do homework or set up a TV for Xbox or anything. Uh, but of course, four beds there, um, lots of storage, lots of sleeping area. Uh, but of course, a nice little bunk area for you guys to take all your kiddos with you while you're uh, camping and have a nice little place to sleep. Here we are in the main bedroom of the 30 DBSC. Of course, this is a full-size queen bed. And as you can see, as I started at, at the very beginning, there is a little bit of room to move at the foot, but not a lot. That's why there's dual entrances. And you can lift up the foot of the bed here to get to the storage. It doesn't give you access to the outside, but a little bit of storage there. Um, dual end tables with uh, GFCI plugins for any kind of CPAP machines or charging your uh, cell phones and all your electronics at night. Lots of storage overhead as well uh, for anything you want to take with you like linens in it as well as that. And of course uh, mirrors with cabinetry on each side for all your hanging goodies uh, like t-shirts, dresses, uh, suit coats or anything like that for when you go on date night make sure, you're so, make sure you look nice and pretty. But awesome little setup here in the main bedroom. And, of course, this has been the 2024 Puma XLE 30 DBSC. Again, my name is Dalton here at RV Wholesalers. We have this video as well as many others. Hope to see you on the next one.